recording session up well it's really all the same session technically but anyway I need my food to cool off I keep burning my tongue despite blowing on it so <laughs> I forgot to make the ancient arrows crumbs hopefully I have enough Marks the quest giver. Okay, me head toward the blue one. What's close to that sort of? Not much. We could hop over and activate that though while we're at it. I'm just doing this till my food goes off. I made some ramen, but oh boy, it's fresh out of the pot. I might have forgotten to make more ancient arrows, but I did mark down some Gerudo shrines. I don't know if we'll hit them today or not. I'm thinking we will because I'd rather that be done and over with. I don't want to deal with Vonda Boris next time. I would prefer it just being effing out of my effing way. You can tell how much I like Vonda Boris by how I talk about it. <laughs> Green one's overshadowing the blue one. Shattering? Shadowing. Here we go, here we go. I only have seven. <clears throat> I'm definitely gonna have to make more though if we do actually head toward Gruta Desert. Easy say though, after this run, I don't think I want to do another run of Breath of the Wild for a while. Maybe I'll do some personal ones, try to get more used to the game, figure out some tricks and crap. You guys make weird sounds, you know that? smell my ramen. It makes me extra hungry, but dang it. <laughs> Daruk, sorry, but I'm gonna disable you for now. Like I said, I, li I, I do enjoy his protection. It's great, but usually I want to try to dodge a hit so I can do a flurry rush or I need to parry. It's only if I'm really desperate that I actually use his protection. Like, if I have tons of guardians around me and there's no way I can parry everything and you can only parry one thing at a time, you're not like Geralt, where you can smack a crossbow bow or arrow out of the air with your sword. Though honestly, if I saw someone do that, I'd be like, okay, I'm not fighting you. <laughs> but yeah, we can't do crap like that against Guardians. Am I gonna need another elixir? Thankfully we do have more because the boss gave us some more. Here we are. The heck? I swear I saw something big fly past me. Okay. 
Okay, here's where we want to be. Oh, there was a way I could walk. Ah. This is why I like Fable 3's Golden Trail. It tells me right where I need to go. Dang, you were working at that so long you passed out. Ooh. Okay, sure. Okay. Alright, here's where the ancient arrows come in. There's enemies down here, and I can't be bothered to kill them. Legitly. Some of them, obviously, I will, because they're not that threatening. <laughs> Do you see me? I don't think he does. I don't dare use a bomb arrow, it's gonna blow up in my face. No, I'm not kidding. Can you hold still for long term? I hate you. Okay, he's dead. He didn't really get his materials like that, but he's dead. Kill him on the way back up. There's gonna be more monsters as it is. It's basically gourmet meat, but rock roast form. <laughs> okay. There's a bunch of them now, as you can see. think about it since am I using an elixir it just ran out but I think I can get away with using elixirs yeah I'm good I need to just not miss now I'm using the ancient bow so I should By the way, if you kill things with ancient arrows, it doesn't count towards your XP. Which makes enough sense to me. Since technically you're cheating. Boulders out of nowhere. Obviously, I save just then in case I lose the rock roasts. No, 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 no. Ugh. I thought that was too steep. better burning property? Acid or lava? I'm asking because of how quick those boulders just disappeared. Goodness. I think acid is slower. Lava is instant. In that case, I would arguably say that lava has the stronger burning property. 
Maybe I'll look it up after this if I remember. Oh, F off. No. I'm not putting this down to kill you. You ain't worth it. Are you serious? Where are these things coming from? How <sighs> much put upon sigh right there? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Go, Link. Okay, I got it. This is sort of stupid. He <laughs> 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 just turns uh. red. Probably eat it either way. Way and seasoning you can do with that, huh? <laughs> Maybe the Goron Spice. <laughs> Give me a mushroom. Because you have. There's 120 of these. <laughs> you know, after a bit, I'm probably not going to get any more shrines, just saying. <laughs> I'll leave them to their celebration and get my shrine. down yet. Mm, mostly. Man, I can't eat ramen anymore unless I add extra seasonings to it. <laughs> garlic plow garlic pow garlic powder. Ground ginger and okay, brown sugar. Oh right, greedy hill. Yes. You know, I don't need money that bad. Ow, I tried to catch it with the thing and it didn't work. Yo, you're in the way, you jerk. Do you think I could actually use this to protect me? Probably not. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think that was gonna work. Wow, that was a crap ton of 20s. Aw, oh, I hate you! Ow! I have something I can jump over one. Well, I think I missed basically all that money, but I'm okay with that because I can kill Stone Talius for money. You're a little rude. <laughs> I bet there's people out there who go out of their way to try to get as many of those 
rubies as possible. Me, I was like, no, I want my orb. <laughs> I don't care about the money. All those 20s were free pickings, though. They came down by themselves. I'll definitely have to upgrade the flame breaker stuff, though. That way I can go around and kill the Inigo Stone Tallis. Take a little bit less damage if I actually have proper defense. <laughs> yeah, this is soaking up all the broth. It's definitely cooled down enough. <laughs> I'll just take a few bites here and there, but I tend not to actually eat the food because the game distracts me too much. So I'll need to legit take a break at some point. So I suppose I took one when I went to cook the food. Can I make that? I think I can, actually. I'm supposed to do like a little stair thing with some iron blocks in the area. But uh, it appears I can just reach this from the tower. There's a fire breath lizard foes in there. Yeah, well he can stay there. <laughs> I don't care about him. Oh, whoops. Wrong set of arrows. Really? It weighed that much? I need these. I don't know if these are hollow or not, but I guess we're about to find out. I don't need all three of them on one, do I? So that would mean Link actually weighs quite a bit if I need all three. <laughs> These aren't gonna help. Get out of here. intellectual over here. Somehow I forgot the spikes. <laughs> Sorry about that, Link. I do believe I had a different shrine on my brain when I was doing that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Link. Gamepad is charged up again. Okay, the only two that I actually strictly have to go to is that one and that one. So, how about we take care of them first, yeah? And my elixir ran out. Am I gonna have to use more of the armor? Hmm. 
Mm. I don't even understand how fairy tonics work. You toss them into the pot with monster parts, but... It's... It just flies around the monster part and then leaves. What's it leaving, fairy dust? <laughs> Maybe. Wait, I actually need that. Maybe. I don't know. Um, I don't have a torch. Hopefully the shrine will offer me one. That should totally be hitting me. Whoa! It fell out! This should just not be working right now. Okay... Do I just legit have to wait till it's done or something? Don't fall off with this, please. I don't have an easy way to get over here without you. Okay, we made it without too much issue. I kind of like this shrine, though. It's very cool. It's actually one I mentioned before that I like at the very end, how it looks. The question is, are they going to supply me with a torch? Let's hope this thing's a torch, yeah? I slid off the edge of it. What was that? Oh, that's unfortunate. I can't do that. I like... It will actually let me do that. Ah, I won't complain. Let's do this carefully, yeah? Be a torch. <sighs> we have to go out and get a torch. Now there's one inside the lab. Let's go get it. I could probably use arrows for the most part, but I really don't want to do that. Wait. Did I still have the other one on me? I assumed I got rid of it. Do I still have it on me? If I do, I'm about to, I'm about to feel very, very effing stupid. <laughs> I feel very effing stupid now. <laughs> this is why you don't make assumptions, guys. 
You don't make assumptions, just don't. <sighs> I have sad. I have extreme sad. <laughs> I could have even used that. have the biggest, most giant sad right now. And I'm not even playing Bloodborne. Oh, there was a torch there. I just assumed it would be in the chest. Again, guys, don't assume. Just don't assume. See what assuming got me? It got me a lot of effing sadness. short enough that- oh, I was about to test if I could just walk. I knew crouching down would make him shorter, so that's why I did it. How am I getting up there exactly? directly on that, yes. Oh, for goodness sake. What? <sighs> now I'm extra sad. working. There we go. Jeez. <sighs> Apparently I can't shoot for crap today even with an ancient bow. there. Okay, that's gonna be impossible. Ow. I'm not gonna bother wasting the Master Sword on these guys. They're not worth it. I thought I would turn enough to the side you couldn't hit me. <laughs> Take that quite happily. If I take too long at this, my noodles are going to get cold. And cold ramen doesn't taste that good.
<laughs> uh, I knew it was gonna happen, but I wanted to hear the little squeak noise it made. <laughs> Needed that stupid laugh right there. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, and this can be annoying. Oh, I got it on the first try. Well, there goes my arrow. <laughs> Let me up, dang it. Good. Not quite, apparently. Okay, I got that one. That's the important bit. Ah. Okay, I have to move you fast. Not that that was particularly challenging. Wait a minute. Oh, you have weapons. Uh oh. I think he was that close to me. <laughs> that was my bad. Ow. I didn't think he was that close to me. You see, this is why I don't kill the mini munch as much. Unless the game gives me no choice, anyway, that'll kill them. Alright. That rooster sounds so upset, dude. <laughs> the neighbor across the street. His rooster's going nuts. <laughs> sounds so upset. Oh crap! <laughs> it almost swiveled the wrong way. Can I set these on fire with the torch? Probably. There's no reason for me to do it, but I kind of want to do it. <laughs> Meh. Whatever. <laughs> I hate everything. I did that slightly wrong. There we go. I don't really like the sword so it can go. Don't want you either particularly. Yeah, just look at this. Doesn't that look so cool? I've always loved that ever since my first playthrough. I forgot to take a picture on my last one though, and I can't do it now since the monk is no longer there. I'll just edit two videos together for this because I want to eat my food now that it's cool. I don't want to have to edit this out though, so I'll just 
edit two videos together. It's easier to do that than edit something out. Okay, that... You know, actually, it's better if I do these first, because I still need the heat protection. Although, if I'm quick, it doesn't matter. Alright, yeah, when we come back, we'll be doing the two shrines in the city, and then we'll go after that one over there. And... I think these just count for this city. I don't know about that one, but I'm going to assume it does. I think these two count for Elden. Dude, it wasn't showing up on my list, though, for the guide, so I'm just guessing. I'm going to say these two and that are part of Elden. And this and these are obviously belong to Wakala, so we'll be doing all of these other ones. In the next video, starting over here. So I'll see you in a bit.